like uh, building the hide, the attention to detail and putting these decoys out is very important. The bird, incoming birds have to believe that these are real pigeons and we can put pigeons down willy-nilly and um, hope for the best but most of the pigeons coming in I want coming into this pattern I want to be able to get them into an area where I can shoot them so we'll leave a little bit of a gap between fairly open area where they can come in and the individual birds we have to get fairly right to start with when we get a lot shot we can put them down on the floor they're okay but initially I like to get them as lifelike as possible I've made my own uh, cradles which are with flexible wire so I can adapt the heads so they can go into a feeding mode or, or up. we can adapt these a little bit. It's important I think to get them just a bit off the ground. If you look at a real wood pigeon walking about feeding it's quite a lot higher than we have a bird flat on the floor. I had one in the pattern the other day, I let it walk about and I thought do any of my decoys look like that? And they did a little but not as good as a real pigeon. So to get them looking lifelike they need to be off the floor a little. Um, the feeding ones we can put with the heads down. And if you want to be really specific, you can pull the legs down as if they are actually standing. And it's something I've done recently and looked from the side and I thought, well, yes, they do look a bit more realistically than just perched in the air for any birds coming in from the side. Obviously with this being freshly drilled there's no growth yet and they want to be fairly low but when we can get um, when we get cover on of course we can use higher cradles um, to get the height of uh, the visibility for incoming birds. So I've just put this one into a feeding mode and that's basically how it should look from the side. Loomis is ready to go aren't you? Again, attention to detail, the feathers on the floor, just cover those up a bit. Especially when you've been shooting and you might have, uh, they're very loose the, the feathers are on a pigeon. And they soon come off and uh, to build the pattern up, it's important to get it right.